So I'm outside the mailbox. Oh my gosh, it's so early. But this um, place where I'm going to is got five star reviews. Everyone that's been there, apparently people go for their coffee here really early. So I'm early. I'm hoping it won't be too packed, but let's have a look. I've got to find it first. This is um, the mailbox in Birmingham and it's always busy. So now I've got to find the place because I've been here a few times and then I've got to go from there. So let's have a look. Okay, so I've just ordered two cakes because there was <laughs> when you see the selection of cakes here you'll understand I was gonna order probably four or five different cakes they're all really nice this place has been recommended and after here I'm gonna go somewhere else as well that's also been recommended so far I like the atmosphere the service is good the cakes are just I can't wait and they're really really thick slices in fact compared to the other places I've been to, especially in the Jewellery Quarter and um, even in, I can't remember, Cannon Hill Park the other day, the prices that they were charging for the cakes there and the little slice of cake you get, you wait till you see this slice of cake that I've got for a cheap price. So, so far so good. Um, and the atmosphere, even though it's morning as well, it feels really nice, it feels relaxed. So let's see, I'll do a proper review after. This is the chocolate Oreo cake. <laughs> Look at the layers on this. This is going to last me a few days. <laughs> so this is one. I can't remember. This was probably, I think it was three, maybe four pounds, five pounds. This is the first one. And I'm going to show you the other one. Now I'm not going to eat these obviously at this time of morning. So I will be having a muffin, as you can see. So I'll have that beautifully decorated and I'll show you the other cake next. You can't go wrong with lemon juice or okay? cake. Um, as I've said, it's morning. I'm not going to eat this now. I'm going to have it later. So the two cakes that I ordered, as I've seen, is the lemon drizzle. I've got my mocha, which I will drink now. And I've got my Oreo cake for later. So the purpose is, if I come somewhere in the afternoon or for brunch, then I'll eat the cakes. And I have been to places later. But when I come in the morning, it's literally just the coffee and then I'll take the cakes home. So you will still get a review, but the review of the cakes will be um, slouch of it, not straight away. I'll have a taste and then review from there. So I've just finished um, having, all I have, I'm going to get people out of the way because I don't want, so I've just had a mucker and um, took away with me two massive slices of cake. So the first one was um, an Oreo cake, <laughs> if you see how big it is and for the price it's really good. The second one was a lemon drizzle cake, smaller piece but do you know what, it looks really tasty so I'm looking forward to trying that. Um, 
I think I'd give this, this is one of the nicest places I've been to. So in this time of morning, because you're in the mailbox and obviously it's city centre in Birmingham, it's very busy. What I like about this place is how friendly it is. The service is nice. I mean, I asked them if I could take pictures and they said yes, they let me video in there. There's different people in there. You don't feel, if you, it's one of the sort of coffee shops where if you come into it by yourself, you can just sit down, you feel relaxed now. <laughs> I'll tell you what, there are some coffee shops, and I didn't realise this, that are quite intimidating. I feel that I probably would sometimes feel more comfortable walking into a club by myself or a bar because coffee shops, people take it seriously. So even in there, I went in a quieter part of it because I was filming and I could see that people were kind of looking. But there was lots of conversations happening. Everyone was relaxed. People, There's work people in there. There's people relaxing. So it's a nice place. I would recommend it. So for the maca, which is very creamy, very nice, I'd give the maca five out of five. I'm full. I feel like even though I've not had any food, I'm full from that maca. It was creamy, it was tasty, it was delicious. The cakes, I haven't tried them yet. So what I'm going to do is try a piece of the cakes and then I'm going to review them later. But overall, Elio Cafe, I would recommend it. It's in the mailbox, it got five star reviews from people. That's why I've checked it out, so I recommend it too. So uh, check it out yourself.